So on the inside of this 10 inch pizza box from Papa John's is a menu side item that I have never tried until right now. That's right guys, for today's review, I'm scratching one off the bucket list by going in on the Papa John's bacon cheese stick. So stay tuned because it's up next for you. I'm Ian Kay, and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Yeah, I'm already salivating for this one, guys. This smells pretty heavenly in the car right now. Feast your eyes on them. The bacon cheese sticks here at Papa John's. A very lovely situation full of cheese. Let me break these on down for you before we get right into them. Yeah, not only is the aroma pretty awesome in my car right now, guys, the presentation of this one is working over my eyeballs very nicely. A very nice presentation indeed. So basically what you're looking at here is some of their fresh dough topped off with garlic sauce as well as a whole bunch of mozzarella cheese, the goodness there, and of course, bacon. A very lovely situation, guys. Looking really nice, cut into 12 individual pieces to go in on. And guys, again, presentation-wise, it looks awesome and it smells awesome as well. For dipping, this normally comes with marinara sauce, but guys, this is Papa John, so I opted for the special garlic dipping sauce for obvious reasons. So some extra garlic's gonna go a long way with this one. I think it's gonna be pretty nice. So there you go. Let's not waste any more time on this one, guys. Let's get into it. These are the bacon cheese sticks here at Papa John's. Let's peep out this flavor. So yeah, banging presentation loaded with cheese and that aroma to match, guys. A very lovely situation indeed. So let me pick up one of these pieces here and we'll get it going. And absolutely a very nice combination of goodness in my hands here right now. A pretty uniform slice as well. Pretty much even across the board. Not too thick, not too thin, but plenty of cheese and that bacon action as well. So here we go. My first time trying it over here at Papa John's, the bacon cheese sticks. Let's peep this out. Mmm loaded with bacon wow flavorful you knew it right well this one's definitely got it going on in the bacon department guys not only that a nice amount of garlic flavor from the sauce on the very bottom underneath the cheese as well as all the goodness that you see there guys with the bacon just a nice combination of goodness with this one just the right amount of toastiness it's a basic little breadstick or cheese stick i should say but man the flavor is definitely tasty let's keep going in and of course we're going to get into some garlic dipping sauce in just a sec hang on Mmm. Wow. Very good. You know, this is kind of taking me back to the jalapeno cheese sticks that I checked out way back in the day over here at Papa John's. Take a look at the review up on the screen here right now. You'll definitely find a lot of tasty goodness in that one. And of course, with the jalapeno to go with. But guys, with this bacon action, a nice combination of goodness. Very, very tasty indeed. Let's go for one more bite on this one and we're going to get into some sauce with another slice. Hang on. Mmm. So side note guys, this actually wasn't available to order in the app when I was checking it out actually, but being that I go up to Papa John's to review pretty often, I did see it on their menu. So I actually had a call in this order. You guys may want to check your menu board to see if you actually have this available in your area, but it's not in the app, at least for me anyway, here in Southern Cali. So I'm glad it is available naturally because I'm glad I'm doing it right now. And of course, we got to pair it up with the garlic sauce. Now normally this does come with the marinara like I may have mentioned earlier, but guys, this is Papa John's. Come on, you got to do that garlic action. A lovely combination indeed and essentially this is going to be a very buttery situation let's go for a little dipping action as always freak nasty when I dip you dip we dip lots of that garlic buttery goodness right there guys let's give this a shot with the garlic mm. I'm tasting it instantly on my tongue mm. buttery garlic cheesy smoky mmm no comfort food right now guys comfort food wow yeah i am digging this and i'm not going to waste any more time on this let's just keep getting right into it to knock off this piece guys a nice combination of goodness just the right amount of saltiness and the butteriness along with the bacon the cheese the light crispiness and the bake on the bottom of the crust itself here very nice let's keep going in mm. this stuff is heaven i love it and nothing against the marinara sauce naturally guys this is obviously where it's at the garlic goodness on top of what's already on here along with everything else how could you fade that so let's go for one more quick bite we'll wrap up this fast review with the rating coming up next but a nice combination i'd highly recommend if you've got this on the menu by you guys definitely give this a go and swap out the marinara for the garlic action easily worth your time let's go for one more bite and we'll wrap it up hang on mm. Well, it's smoky, it's cheesy, and it's got a nice amount of garlic sauce on its own, guys. But I gotta say, dipping it into that garlic sauce is a very heavenly experience. I'd highly recommend that. A nice combination of goodness with this one, baked up fresh. And I gotta say again, an easy recommendation. Guys, it's bacon and cheese. How bad could this really be? Definitely give this one a shot if you haven't already.
So yeah, I'm glad I'm checking this one out today, guys, because not only am I scratching this one off the Papa John's bucket list, I actually wanted to see how this version was compared to the recent Pizza Hut variant that I checked out, which you're probably seeing up on the screen here right now, the bacon cheddar situation. That was pretty tasty. So Papa John's is absolutely different in terms of flavor, and that's actually a good thing because this really does feel like a different product, even though it's very similar. But guys, the combination of the garlic sauce with that, that really is the caveat that changes the game completely over here at Papa John's. And like you've heard me say ad nauseum in this review, it's easily worth giving a shot with it. You really need to be doing that. It's pretty awesome. So with that, I'm going to have to give the bacon cheese sticks here at Papa John's a rock solid 9 out of 10. The only thing I can really see being a little bit of a hit on this one is the price point. At about $10 for what this is, it's a little on the expensive side, but at the same time, it's a different experience completely compared to the other versions that may be out there from the other guys. And guys, like I said, it's Papa John's, so that garlic goodness is amazing. I would recommend giving this one a shot if you haven't already. It's easily worth your time, at least just once to give it a go. Still pretty tasty for what it is. All right, so do me a quick favor like always. Drop those comments down below. Let me know what you thought of the look of these bacon cheese sticks over here at Papa John's. And if you've got them available in your area, how often do you get them? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is ENK closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep This Out Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why you stay tuned for the next video coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I couldn't do it without you and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's gonna recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.